Hey guys, welcome back to Subnautica. We made a lot of progress on our last episode. I'm pretty sure we, we almost caught up to where I was uh, on the out other uh, hour and a half that I had played. Um, the only thing that I had there that I no longer have is um, I had uh, I had a couple of these things. I had uh, the Sea Glide. I think that's it. I think I had the Sea Glide, and I did actually have the high capacity oxygen tank as well. Um, but uh, once we get a silver piece, we should be able to get that. Do we? We didn't use all the glass, right? We th just threw that in our chest, I think. Mix some filtered water. Always looking for filtered water, and then we'll cook a whole fish, I guess. It's a whole fish, guys. Not just part of a fish, it's a whole fish. <laughs> um, let's see. So, uh, if you guys have been watching it all, you know I've been watching a lot of, uh, I've been watching a lot of D&D. &D. I've been watching a lot of Critical Role. I really like it. It's, uh, and I've been noticing just all the different accents that the characters on there can use, and it's really, really cool. Um, let's see. What are we looking for before I get sidetracked here uh, on a conversation? We are looking for silver ore, or we're looking for pieces for the, the sea glide. So let's keep that in mind while we're looking about. Um, so uh, let's see. Anything I haven't scanned yet? Can we scan all these things? Um, but yeah, like seeing all the accents they can do, it's like the time that goes into that, you know, like sea glad fragment. Okay, sweet. Like learning an accent. What's that? That's floating over here. Um, I have no idea how, how to do that. I'm, I'm a little nervous here. Um, takes a lot of work you know first you got to figure out um the vowel sounds right because you got your because you know in a american you know it's just like a e i o u so you got to work on um i'm not gonna you know i think like for for maybe british in, in like a british accent for british you know the the, the, the british language <laughs> um oh hello Hey, I just dodged that. That makes me cool. I'll take the cave sulfur. And then possibly also the quartz. Oh, that's nice. Is a of the reef in huh, okay, I didn't scan that. Oh, I haven't scanned this either. Okay, let's scan this. But like, uh, um, in a British X, it's like A-E-I-O-U, perhaps? Is that... Sound about right. Copper. I'll take the copper. Sandstone is what we want. Uh, for silver ore, I think. I'll back up and go back to that uh, thing over here. Replenish our supplies. So, like, you got a... a what's, what's this little... Um, we'll just get refill our stuff. I saw some particles coming up, and I was a little bit confused. I think we're fine, though. Um, so yeah, that's, that's a, a British accent's different than that. Um, we already, we already got these ones. Oh, it's all dark now. I don't like it when it's dark, but then you gotta like work on like uh, different pronunciations of different words. And I don't know. Like I've always, I've always like liked the idea of learning a bunch of accents. I think that a lot, I'm not the only one. I think a lot of people kind of have that. Sort of like, man, that'd be cool if I were to do that. And then they don't do it because it's, it's a lot of work. Um, um, I'm good on hell. I'm good on food right now. So there's not really much of a point in grabbing something. Uh, maybe in this giant cave we can find sandstone. Is there anything in here? Eh, before I go in here, I should probably go surface up. I really do wish there was a way to skip the day and night cycles. And maybe there is, and I just don't know it yet. Um, that's, I mean, one, I'm terrified 
of the night here. <laughs> but uh, also just visibility. I have a, did I, I, did I make a flashlight? I don't think so. I made a flashlight on the other file. I did not make a flashlight on this one though. Okay, we, maybe we can go. We need to find more scraps of stuff so that we can, uh, so that we can make a sea glide. I think the sea glide is kind of the next goal, perhaps. Um, let's see. Oh, let's get some oxygen, perhaps. Have I not scanned metal salvage? Now I have. Oh, we're getting a message. I see, yeah, that's a little radio icon, I think. I guess we should head back then. Oh, there's something down here. Hmm. Oh, there's a crash fish. Ah, blew me up. Don't like you. Don't like you. Don't blow me up. Don't do it. Um, doesn't actually hurt that much. I thought that, that a fish that blows up would do a lot more damage. But, uh, no, not really. No. Um, let's play the radio message, I guess. Receiving pre-recorded distress call laying back. This is Life Pod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Huh. Okay. That didn't happen last time. That's interesting. Um. What do I still want? Silver ore? And then I'll make a filtered water from the bladder fish. I should always be on the lookout for bladder fish, probably. Make some glass from that, I guess. Copper wire. What can I do with copper wire again? Do I need that for the sea glide? Do I even know? I don't even know what I need for the sea glide. Okay. Hmm. I wish. Maybe I can make a flashlight. Maybe that's what I need to do. I didn't make one already, yeah? No? Okay. Let's make a flashlight then. If I can... I need a battery. I think I can make a battery. Uh, acid mushrooms. I've got plenty of those. Continued degradation of the Aurora drive core may result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. Um... So yeah, the, the Aurora, the giant ship is just like leaking a bunch of fluid and gas and it's like, ooh, maybe we should have. Uh... I think that what I think is going to happen is I think this is going to be like a play on, you know, like they're going to start talking about like, oh, if we hadn't come here, you know, the life, the life uh, ecosystem would be fine. And, you know, humans messed it all up and all that kind of jazz, or at least that'll be like one of the themes of the thing, uh, whether or not that stands to be we'll see um do i carry a life thing on me oh, i don't really know what i need and what i don't need oh it's rotten i should probably just throw it out instead of keeping it in a chest <laughs> um repair tool has to be charged as well i do have a battery does the battery deplete after a while like if i just leave the battery somewhere okay well we do have a flashlight now Just in time for me to not need it anymore, it would appear. Shallows. Crew reported their sea glide damaged. Do I go over there? I wonder that. I don't want to turn this on. I want to turn it off. That's pretty far. I don't really want to go that far. I want to... Uh, I want to find some scavenge, some scavenge stuff so that I can make a sea glide. That is my preference. Oh, hello. What 
Oh. I don't know. Hmm. I haven't, I haven't scanned a hoverfish. Now I have. Hello. Hmm. Oh, hello. I'll stab you. Stab you. I'll do it. Leave me alone. Um. Man, last time it was so easy to find scavenge stuff. And now I'm having some problems. Oh, dear. What's happening? That was an interesting thing that happened there. Seemed the stalker ran in the middle of those toxic things and that was interesting. Hey there, buddy. Hello. Don't make me I'll stab you again. I'll do it. Fight me. Fight me. I'll got you. You can't you can't stop this. Get out of here. Yeah, that's right. You better run. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. They're running through the ground. That's cool. Oh, what my word. I'll fight you. Try me. Um, doesn't really help me out much as far as finding what I'm looking for, though. Seriously? Get out of here. I can still fight you. Um, some more rocks. Copper is nice. All right. Um, there's too many of these stalkers around. What are they doing here? I need some scavenge. Is what I need. Where did my ship go? There it is. Hmm. Hmm. I don't really need all this metal scavenge yet. I need like so that's that's scrap metal. I don't really need scrap metal. What I need is which direction is the this way? Okay, we're going this way. So we can find some sort of scrap metal. Not, I'm sorry, not scrap metal. I meant a uh, little like things that I can scan to get the to get the power glide thing, the sea glide, whatever it is. You know what I'm saying? Ah, there's too many of these freaking stalkers around. Anything in here? I don't think anything I want right now. Hmm. All right, let's go surface. We're getting kind of close to the ship. That's another thing I, I did on the last thing I did. Uh, I didn't have to look up. It took me a really long time. It took like me three episodes to figure out uh, to figure out where to find the cave stuff. The creature are you gonna hear? Can I scan it? No. Um. It took me like three episodes to figure out where to find the cave sulfur. So uh, I ended up just like looking up where to find it. It's probably a bad idea. Should have done it, but. Um, but in like everywhere in the comments, you know, it was kind of hard to avoid. You would just see, uh, Ooh. all right. It feels like a waste to avoid getting hit and then not grab the cave sulfur. Um, so I guess I'll grab it. But yeah, everywhere in the comments on the wiki, they're like, oh, don't go near the ship towards the start. Don't go near the ship towards the start. Um, and I don't know why, but uh, 
I'm a scaredy cat, and I'm gonna listen to the. I'm gonna listen to all the comments, and I'm not gonna do it. I'm not doing it. I don't know. It was kind of a bummer. I didn't really want it, want it to be spoiled like that, you know. But that's how it goes. Where is some scrap metal? Not scrap metal. I keep on saying scrap metal. I don't mean scrap metal. I mean parts to scan. I need some parts. It's a little bit hard because just by looking down, you kind of trend downwards. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna have to go into the K the kelp area if I want to find what I'm looking for, huh? Anything down here? What are you? That's just a creature egg. I'm gonna leave it alone. Another freaking stalker. There's so many stalkers in those areas. There's a box though. Thirty seconds. That's what I wanted. There we go. Getting out of here. New blueprint acquired. All right, we got our sea glide stuff. I'm getting out of here now. And now we'll go. We'll go make a sea glide. Oxygen. And then I guess we'll go to the waypoint. I would have preferred to have a high oxygen capacity tank thing but if we can't get it then that's just how it is all right what do we need we need copper wire and lubricant which i believe we have in a chest over here which we do pulled out throw the cave sulfur in there again i guess this is rotten i forgot to throw it out all right there we go that's a sea glide Your effective exploration range. Lovely. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. Lovely. Um. Get another <laughs> medical kit. Uh, we'll leave this. One, we'll keep this one on us. Um, I think we should drink this water. And bring another water with us. We'll grab one water, one food for the trip. Oh, my nose itches. There we go. We're all better. Um, I guess we go out and find it now. So now we got this power glide. Check that out. Where'd that radio signal? Okay, let's go to the radio signal. Mew. This is going a lot faster for certain. For certain. Just going right right through here. Oh, comes back up, huh? We should still be on the lookout for uh for scavenge. See if we can pick up any parts like right here. Anything in here? Yep. All right. Nice. Um, kind of avoiding, kind of avoiding the stalkers right now if I can help it. I think I can go a lot faster than that than, than them now. Oh, okay. Hello. Abandoned pod. Integrating new PDA data. Got a compass. New blueprint acquired. Anything else in here? Something damaged their thing. Hmm. It's outside. Sea glide fragment? Didn't we already get? Didn't we already get a sea glide? We don't need a. We don't need another sea glide fragment, do we? 
Oh, we just get scrap for it instead. Do we need salt? I guess we could use some more metal salvage. There's a stalker. Should we head back? There's our pot over here. We certainly go a lot faster with this thing. Okay. So let's see. Um, we'll play the stuff when we get back. We got like a compass, I think. Here's something. I think we're much faster than it now though. Vroom, vroom. All right, let's go up. Oh, the radio. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't want us. This might happen. Mm. Our pod was almost crushed by this Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. So I guess those guys died, the first ones we ran into. Or no, they, maybe they just abandoned the pod. Because um, what do we just get? We just got something, right? Data downloads or survivors, this one. Glycos a mass of 80 kilograms at over 30 kilometers an hour. The power cell rig for this one should double that. You think there's something out there that's faster? I'm sure. And that's assuming it doesn't overload three meters from the light pod. You're calm hmm. about this. I'm seeing the engineering problem. If I stop seeing the maps, I'll be terrified. Oh my word, that's scary. Scattered wreckage. Um. All right, let's see. Well, we found what? What do we find? Compass. We need a wiring kit for that. A wiring kit. We need two silver ore. So that's kind of where we're at right now. We need two silver ore. Um, Congratulations, survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Oh. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. Right, thanks for that one. Uh, get some more filtered water. Super easy to do. And let's just drink the water straight up right now. Um, I need some food too. If I can catch one of these guys, that'd be good food. There we go. There we go. That's probably enough food for right now. We'll go and cook that up. And while I'm out here, while I'm out here, toss the this out. Oh, did I eat that? No, I didn't want to eat that. That's stupid. I wanted to throw it out. That's dumb. That's fine. We're about to cook some more food. Get some peepers. Some peepers. Papers, please. Eat it up. All right. Didn't end up mattering all that much. Uh, we do need more water at some point. I think the next real thing that we need is going to be that uh, silver ore. I'm not quite certain how to get it. I don't know if there's a certain area that it appears in. Um, we could start in here, though. What's that noise? Oh, my word. What are these stalkers doing right here? Get out of here. You guys suck. Okay, um. Limestone. I need sandstone. Um. The sandstone ones are gonna get me the. The, uh, stuff I need. Are you sandstone? No. 
No. Some more fun little guys. Oh. Oh, your boy forgot to get oxygen. Oh. We're all good. We're surviving. Okay, turn off the light. Okay, there was not any in there. Hmm. Let's go back up, I guess. Everything's online. Hmm. Well, we could go to the other uh, thing. Life pod 17, stranded near a cave system and under attack. I get the feeling that anything we find is going to already be uh, dead. Because I haven't seen any people in this game. So, I don't know. I'm feeling like we don't need to rush over there. There's no reason to rush into something unprepared. I'd really like to get that high capacity oxygen tank before we go that far out. Um, and yeah, that might be a good spot to stop. We, we, uh, went and checked out the other, um, went and checked out the other thing, uh, got a sea glide and we're working towards making a high capacity oxygen tank. This is pretty much where I was at before. I did have the high capacity oxygen tank cause I found some silver early on. But other than that, uh, this is pretty much where I was, um, so uh, it'll be new stuff from here on out. So, uh, I mean, everything was new for you guys, but it'll also be new for me. Or maybe it wasn't new for you because you played this game. And uh, you're like, why are you playing this game that's been out for like three years, Cameron? And I may be like, I don't know. Because I wanted to. Don't judge me. <laughs> uh, so if you liked, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.